EA Sports. It's in the game. EA Sports. It's in the game. Madden NFL 2004. Hold on the roof and all, we come to you from Texas Stadium where the fans are eagerly anticipating today's game. We're glad you could join us for our first broadcast of the year. Today's matchup looks like it'll be a great battle between two very evenly matched teams as the Falcons match up against the Cowboys. Welcome to another presentation of NFL football. Hi everyone, I'm Al Michaels, and with me as always, John Madden. Now here's one of the better quarterbacks in the league. And the great thing about him is that he always gets the job done. Maybe it's selling a play pass or throwing a block on a reverse. He's always out there doing the little things to help his team to victory. The former All-America from Tennessee will be his go-to guy once again and for obvious reasons. He's one of the better route runners and always seems to make the catch in traffic. Stopping this combo hasn't been easy for many defenses, so we'll have to see what type of coverages they go with to prevent these two from doing a lot of damage. They do stuff like that these days. You get all warmed up, stretch a little, then you get together as a team, say a little something, then you start going crazy. Both teams have taken the field, and the season is about ready to get started. Feely is back and ready to put this one in the air. Not a real deep kick. Should be returned from the 12. The Cowboys will start this drive from the 28-yard line. Beckett is out at halfback for today's game. His mobility has really been limited by his leg injury, and he's still going to be out for some time. Campbell, the man in motion. Looking to run it here. Gain of about five. The Falcons come out in a nickel package. He has four, maybe five yards on that carry. Third and maybe one. You got him. Mad dog go. They got enough. Bull dog go. And he'll get the call. So he works his way past the marker for a first down. In motion. Going to the right. Cross play goes for about four. They'll go from the I formation. Campbell goes in motion. Aims it off to the back. Pickup of about a yard in the run. They need five. Ball on their own 44. Give it all you got, Come on. The Cowboys using motion. 
pressure with the throw. He hits his receiver. Nice call going to the air, and that'll move the chain. The quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. But when there's nothing open downfield, you just can't throw it up there. It's second down and 15 to go. Ball on their own 46. He gets the carry. Just about two yards on the run by the halfback. So they dug themselves into a hole here, a long third down situation. Ball on their own 48. Drops back. Pressure coming. Throwing. He finds his man. And he's brought down at the 38 yard line. Watch it here. This is a great call on third down to keep this drive alive. They were in a tough spot here. But this is a heck of a throw and catch to pick up that first down. They'll go from the I formation. Hutchinson gets set. Throwing on first down. Gets rid of it. Pass ball's incomplete. Williams just made a great defensive play. He's got great recovery speed. He can catch up to the ball even if he's caught out of position. That time he was right there in the secondary to tip the ball away. Set. Dropping back. Closing in. Gets the pass off. What happened there, John? That's the old rule. If you get your hands on it, you got to catch it. Only one man back. Man in motion. Gets rid of it. Incomplete. Number 29. Made a great defensive play, tipping the pass away. He has to do a better job of looking off the coverage before he makes a throw like that. Going. We'll come into this game to punt. Russell lines up deep for the punt return. And he waves for the fair catch. Into the end zone, touchback. So the offense sets up for its first drive of the game. The former first overall pick out of Virginia Tech. One of the best and most exciting quarterbacks in the league. And he has a great arm, is excellent at reading the defense. The other thing he's got is patience, which is one of the underrated qualities in a quarterback. Having a good arm doesn't mean a whole lot if you have to try and muscle the ball into double coverage. And they beat the blitz on a good throw. And that's a heck of a pass. He's got those big old defensive linemen flying right at him, and he showed great composure, making the right read and hitting his receiver. Man in motion. Drops back. Pressure. So they'll lose yardage on that tackle by Ekubon. The defense is hurting themselves with penalties. The defense looks a little anxious out there. They need to do a better job of concentrating to prevent dump penalties like that one. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 32. Using motion. Cross play to the left. Newman came up and shut down the run. Yeah, they tried to get around the end. He came up from his corner position, and boom, he makes a heck of a tackle. Second and long. Hey, no. 
Done. The lone setback. Man in motion. Going to the right. He got his hand on the face mask there, and it cost him. That defender almost pulled his helmet right off. Third and seven coming up here. Ball on their own 35. With two extra defensive backs, the defense is in the dime. Under pressure, gets the pass off, gets away. He makes a terrific catch for the first down. Even the receiver was surprised how quickly that one got to him. That's the kind of thing you just hope you can hang on to as it goes by. At the end of the first quarter, we're all even. Dallas, zero. Atlanta, zero. The teams ask which sides, and we'll strike the second quarter. The backs are lined up in an eye. Passing on first down. With the pass, this one falls incomplete. Look at the big old defensive line. Does a heck of a job of getting in the passing lane and knocking down the pass. Second and ten. Ball on their own 48. And this is the seventh play of this drive. Pressure coming. Looking downfield. Gets the pass off. Hits him in stride. The 20. The 10. Touchdown, Falcons. He delivered that pass right on time. Perfectly for the touchdown. The quarterback went through his progression. He found the receiver that he thought had the best chance to haul it in for the score. So they'll try to tack on the extra point. The kick is up, and the extra point is good. And so a big drive for this offense as they put together a nice string of plays that takes them down the better part of the field for the touchdown. Now that's just the type of thing that you come to expect from these guys. They do a really good job scripting the plays that they're going to be running. And they do a great job of executing them when they run them. Here's the kickoff team. Should be a return here. And they are about ready to get this drive started after the last series ended with a punt. Set with only one back behind him. Decent gain, about four. Anderson. Straight ahead for a gain of a couple. They'll go from the I formation. Well, setting up play action, throws it, and the catch is made. You can't draw it up any better than that. Textbook first down.
Hammer in the backfield. Hammer. And he's tackled behind the line by Stewart. He was met right at the line, might have even lost a little. That was a case of the defense getting under the pads of the offensive line. Usually the team that gets the best leverage is going to control the line of scrimmage. When you run it into the middle, you have to have some push or movement up front. If you can't get that movement, it makes things very difficult for your running back. We give it to the halfback. Pickup of about eight. Come out of the nickel. Let's go, come on. And this is the sixth play of the strike. He hands it off. Not what they were looking for on that play for. Yeah, the back just couldn't decide where he wanted to go with it. He hesitated just a little. By the time he decided where he wanted to go with it, the defense was all over him. Going is back to punt. Russell looks like he's ready for the return. Here's the kick. Fair catch called for. There was no need to try and return that one. So he made the right decision there. Let's go. Come on. Bust this grill, deep. 94. Well done. Closing in. A lot of room to work with. The 50. Beautiful to pick up a first down. I'll tell you what, you can't give him any lanes at all. He can take it and throw it in that lane, or what he did right there. He'll run right through the lane. So we have first and ten here. Only one man back. Gives the ball off. Done with a nice run and picks up the first down. And it was well executed. They hit their blocks and the back found the right hole to get down the field and pick up a first down. It's first and ten. Ball on the 25-yard line. The Falcons come out with four wide receivers lined up tight. Pressure, throws it, the pass is picked off. The 40, the 50, the 40, the 30. A lot of room to work with. The 10, and he showboats his way toward the end zone. Touchdown, Dallas. Hopefully went up to get that one. The quarterback telegraphed that one. The kicker lines up for the point after. And it's on its way, and he picks on the extra point. Kickoff team lines up. 
It's on its way. From the five-yard line. That interception brought their last drive to a sudden halt. After collecting themselves on the sidelines, let's see what happens here. So they have first and ten here. The quarterback lines up with two options behind him. They'll pass on first down. Gets the pass off. This pass is incomplete. A jarring blow on that one. Yeah, it jarred that ball right out of there. Dallas comes out in their nickel package. Dropping back. Here's an open. The 30. Let's see how this defense handles a no huddle. Under pressure. Second and short upcoming after that great run. This might be the easiest conversion the team will face today. That was a gutsy play by the quarterback to get that kind of yardage on first down. Ooh, nearly picked off. I thought that was about to be picked off, John. Yeah, he had an excellent opportunity to end the drive right there. He just couldn't bring it in. On a third and short situation like this, the defense has to be ready for anything. They wanted to pound it through the middle, but they got pounded for a loss. I'll tell you, that was a perfect time for these guys to call a blitz. They got in there, filled the gap, and brought down the back for a loss. They can't keep it going, and more than likely, we'll see the punter. Moore is looking for a good punt here. Swinton gets up to run back the punt. Here's the punt. Turn is setting up nicely, and he has room to run with it. He had an outstanding return. Sometimes, as a coverage team, it's easy to over-pursue. And if you do that, you end up running right by the guy you're supposed to be tackling. It's first and ten. Ball on the 39-yard line. Set. Hutchinson sets up. Bryant moves in motion. Heat. Throwing on first down. Pressure coming. Gets the pass off. Incomplete. The quarterback thought he had that one. You got to deliver the ball out there quickly, but it has to be catchable. You got to use some touch. Time running out, and it looks like this one will be tied at the half. Atlanta comes out in the quarter defense. Set. Bring that pain, baby. Hut. 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 Stepping up, gets rid of it. Incomplete pass, so he can't come up with it. That's the type of pass that you got to be able to hang on to. It's third down and ten to go. Ball on the 39-yard line. Dropping back. Throws it. Incomplete. He's having a tough time getting anything going on this drive. And you have to give credit to the defense out there. Those last few times he dropped back to throw, he didn't look comfortable. And that's because they did a good job confusing him with their schemes and their coverages. The coverage team needs to play more discipline on this punt because you don't want to give the other team any momentum going into the half. They have to stay in their lanes. He's waving for the fair catch. Vic sets up. Done. Win gets right in there and brings him down. 
done. Wasn't able to get anything going on that play. They got there and shut that play down very quickly. That's just a case of studying game film this week paying off. When you know what they like to run in certain situations, you can anticipate the play call and stop the play before it even gets started. At halftime, Dallas 7, Atlanta 7. Welcome back as we get the second half underway. And the kickoff team comes out onto the field. Good distance. From the four yard line. The Falcons will start the drive from the 23 yard line. So they have first and 10 here. Ball on their own 23. Snickers! Bulldog under! Set! Cut! 94! Cut! Done! Just about a yard on the run. They'll go from the eye formation. Closing in. It's rid of it. Pass ball's incomplete. It looked like he'd come up with it, but he just couldn't get it under control. He did a nice job of getting off the line and getting into his pass pattern. But he had the ball bounce right off his fingertip. And they'll face a long third down here. Ball on their own 23. That gets set. Drops back. Pressure with the pass. This one falls incomplete. Williams got a hand up and tipped that pass away. He has a great feel for defending the pass. And he always seems to be in great position to make a play in the ball. Moore lines up in the backfield for the punt. Here's the kick. from the 44 yard line the 30 he's on the run the 10 touchdown Cowboys a huge touchdown on the punt return that guy just broke into the open and then he was gone they'll get set for the extra point The point after is good. They've now scored 14 unanswered points. This is one of those teams that's never out of a game. If you let them get going early, they can really control the tempo of the game. If they fall behind, they have the weapons on the offensive side to put points on the board very quickly. And the kickoff team comes out onto the field. Good kick should be returnable. From the six. Atlanta is down by one touchdown. They line up in the eye formation. Loses the defense. That was actually designed for the quarterback to run, and that's just what he did. Defense! 
It's third down with three to go. Ball on their own 29. He calls his own number, picks up yardage. Unable to get anything going on that series. They'll have to punt it away here. Here's the punt. From the 40. The 40. Just a great punt return there, John. And then he just ran out of steam. But I'll tell you this, he gave him great field position. Trying to find some room in the middle, but there was no place to go. I'll tell you what happened. The defense was coming with a lot of guys in a run blitz, and the hole that that play was supposed to go through was filled with defenders. Falls incomplete. Ball got up and knocked that pass away. That's what you look for. You have guys watch film each week. You try and figure out where he likes to go with the ball in certain situations. Then when you face that situation in the game, you're right there in position to knock the pass away or force an interception. This is going to be about a 45-yard field goal attempt. The kick is up. to the left, plows ahead. He goes down at the 38, just about three yards there. Dallas comes out in their nickel package. Crosses it left, and that's a stiff one. Well, he's shaken up after that play, and we'll get you a report from the sideline when we get the information. They need five. Ball on their own 40. Griffith is the deep back. Under pressure. Breaks free. Right here is how he can hurt you. They get him in a third down situation. But if they can give him a lane to run through, he's going to take it. And right there, he takes it for a big first down. Let's go. Come on. Throwing the first down. Pressure coming. Well, John, they kept it in the quarterback's hand. And they didn't get anywhere. The quarterback got knocked around, but that was about it. Gets set with only one back behind him. Done. Didn't get any help from his offensive line. It was just about impossible to run when you have guys in the backfield 
just as soon as you snap the ball. The Cowboys come out with three down linemen and seven defensive backs. And this is the sixth play of this drive. Closing in, gets rid of it. Right on the mark there to move the chains. And the thing is, the secondary looked a little on their heels on that one. They just couldn't converge on the ball in time, and now they get a whole new set of downs. It's first and ten. Ball on the 24-yard line. Throws it. This one falls incomplete. He came free on that play, but he couldn't make the catch. Sometimes you see the receivers drop the easiest passes. They must be thinking touchdown before making the catch. Only one man back. Vick sets up. He gets the count. Five-yard pickup on that run by the tailback. So after that run, we can see how the two main threats on the ground have fared so far. Third and five. Ball on the 20-yard line. That was actually designed for the quarterback to run, and that's just what he did. So we've reached the end of the third quarter with the Cowboys ahead of the Falcons 14 7. The teams are set for the fourth quarter of play. Feely. Heads out onto the field for the field goal attempt. And it's up. The kick is good. The Falcons find themselves right back in this one. Now it's up to the defense to hold them. Here's the kickoff team. Sends it sail. From the five yard line. The Cowboys will start the drive from the 24. Field. Four yards picked up there by the fullback. Second and six coming up here. Ball on their own 28. Man in motion. Pressure throws it. The defenders got it. He got way up there to make the pick. I'll tell you, these interceptions are all about timing. And he timed that jump perfectly. Following the interception, it's now first and ten. Get at him. Get, get. Only one man in the backfield. Under pressure with the throw. Great pass. And he stopped at the 16. A display of great hands on that catch. That receiver has all the tools. That gets set. He has some room. He's inside the tank. Watch. Now, the key to this first down was the fact that the defense lost containment on the quarterback. He's out there running around, and that time, it got him a first down. So it's first and goal. On the 
they'll mark it at the two-yard line. Dunn was dragged down before he could get to the line of scrimmage. They have great size and quickness up front. That allows them to hold up against the run while also giving them the speed to rush the passer when they drop back the pass. Get in there, Ron! Dunn. The offensive line looked like they just collapsed on that play. The offensive line has to get good movement on the snap of the ball for the inside run to work, and it didn't happen on that play. So now we have third and goal. The quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. Now watch how this defense comes up with a big stop. They're backed up in their own end zone trying to keep those guys off the board, and they make a play like that. That's a heck of a defensive play. They go for it and don't make it. That was a conversion the offense needed. They have to be disappointed, and it's worse because now the other team has the ball. Using motion. Hambrick. They'll bring him down at the seven yard line. Pickup of about a yard in the run. Eight to go. Ball on their own seven. is helped by that penalty. That was just one of those stupid penalties. What was that guy thinking? Second and maybe three. Ball on their own 12. Just about a three-yard gain there. the two-minute mark. Come on now. Ain't nothing. Hand it off again. He picked up just enough. First down coming up after that run. This one is just about in the books. Atlanta will call a timeout here. They have two timeouts left. Tucks it away. Atlanta calls a timeout. They have one remaining. Hammer didn't have much to work with on that running play. That's because the defense did a good job anticipating the snap count. With an aggressive defense like this, a hard count could be an effective way to keep them off balance while trying to draw them off sides. On the call, about a two yard gain here. Third and long. 
Ball on their own 20. Good gain of about seven on that play. I bet the defensive coordinator is telling his guys on the sidelines to get ready because it'll be up to them to stop any comeback attempt and hold on for the win. Russell is back to receive this kick. Here's the kick. From the 34 yard line. Good return there. That could have been a real big one. Hey, he showed some good vision there. You have to see the entire field in an instant and just take off towards the open field. It got him a nice return for their team. The quarterback trying to get his team closer here on first down. And it's every quarterback's dream to drive his team down and throw the touchdown that brings him back. I'll tell you, he wants nothing more than to do that right here. With the pass, he got his hands on it, but the pass was incomplete. This is one of those guys who's working really hard to improve himself. Every now and then, he'll let one bounce off his hands like that, but most of the time, you can rely on him to make the catch when you really need it. Second down now. They have to get closer to the end zone. The Cowboys line up in the quarter defense. He's rid of it. He was in perfect position to make that catch. Yeah, the receiver showed great concentration looking that one right into his hand. What they're doing here is keeping the defense from huddling up. It keeps the same defense on the field. Down he goes at the 49-yard line. They'll go no huddle here. With the throw, the defenders got it. The defender was all over that one. He just stepped in front of that one. He saw his opportunity, and boom, he took it. With the defense not having all of its timeouts, they'll probably come out and take a knee here on first down. The Falcons call a timeout. They have no timeouts left. This one's just about over. The defense doesn't have enough timeouts to get the ball back, as long as the offense takes a few kneel down. Third down and long coming up here. Ball on the 38 yard line. Lose it, lose it. The gun signals the end of the game. The final score is Dallas 14, Atlanta 10. This concludes another EA Sports presentation. For John Madden and Melissa Stark, this is Al Michaels saying so long.